Let's look at your email template manager so we can show you how easy and fun it is to create email templates. When you first set up your account, this will actually be empty and you can quickly load in some of the pre-built templates that we've built for you. Uh, feedback and review quests, feedback requests, negative feedback, um, order shipment information, etc. Um, or you can create a new email from scratch. So I'll very quickly show you. So inside the template builder, this is your internal template name. So when you create campaigns, this is what you're going to reference. Um, here's your subject line, your corporate style, if you wanted to add a blue bar on the top, gray bar, etc. cetera. Um, and then internally, what kind of email type this is. So when you have a bunch of emails, you can very quickly say, okay, this is for reviews, etc. Here's your logo image. We'll show you what that does in a second. And then you can easily add email attachments. And then up here are all of your formats options and it really is um, a live preview uh, platform so it's pretty it's pretty incredible to be able to see exactly what my email is going to look like on the right here and so let's go let's jump into one of our test templates and we can show you some of the fun things that you can do so we built this test email here and you can see we've got um, the name subject filled out we added our corporate logo so that shows up automatically underneath our signature and then at the top here um, we have logo image as well um, we don't have any attachments and so right off the bat this this show variables variables button is is pretty awesome so it gives you a list of some of the more commonly used variables and links that you're going to need inside your emails without needing to know how to code or any of that so you literally just hit insert into editor and it just drops it in right there so right there is the product price um, if I wanted to add um, a link for um, storefront, insert it into editor, and it says visit our store. Now, if I wanted to change that text, visit our store, I just highlight this text and type in whatever I want, okay? And so you can instantly see exactly what's happening there. If I want to um, add an image, just come up here, say picture, and I can choose a file, and then um, if I want to change any of the formatting, the font, that's pretty pretty easy to do. And so, and, and it all updates in real time automatically. Now, these funny animated GIFs are really cool. So, so let's say I wanted to say, you know, please rate your experience. You know, to give us some feedback. Did you did you like um, how we shipped our item? Did you like the item? Um, did it meet your expectations? So let's go ahead and add a variable. Uh, let's do product review. Let's do uh, yeah feedback request. Let's enter this into there. And I want to, um, instead of having text there, I want to make that a fun image that they can click on, a button. So I'm going to highlight this leave feedback. I'm going to delete that. I'm going to come up here. I'm going to do a picture. And I'm going to come over here. I'm going to grab this fun GIF. Drop this into here. And there you go. Automatically, that, that sets up as a button. If they click on that button, um, they, they'll be able to take, they'll be taken right to our feedback review link. And so you could have two positive, negative. And if I want to resize that button, it's very easy. I can drag and drop from the corners here, or I can do these quick buttons, 25%, um, 50%, et cetera. And so it's a really fun way to add a little bit of interactivity to your emails. Um, but I wouldn't, go, don't go overboard. Um, as long as all the linking in your email takes back to the Amazon platform, um, you're, you're more than likely going to be inside Amazon's terms of service. Um, but anything beyond that is, you, you know, you're taking a risk. So, so really, it's, it's a fun way to um, create personalized custom emails, but you don't need to know any code. It's super simple and super easy. So anything from highlighting, um, fonts, all the stuff that, you know, it's hard to do in HTML and CSS, um, it's super easy to do here. So I can come up here. I can make this a header. Oop, i got to highlight. Come over here and make this a header. And so it's really fun and easy to do. And of course, if I wanted to do a PDF or some sort of you know lifetime warranty or value add, you come over here and you attach the email. And then you can, of course, send a test email to yourself, um, save the template um, for, uh, for further editing. And then let's go back into the template manager. So one thing I forgot I wanted to show you when you go inside your live email preview, you can very quickly see what this would look like for various orders. And so it's a nice way to, to update that so you can see how personalized it'll be. And so here are all of my templates, and that's very easy. I can quickly jump into edit. I can duplicate 
I can throw them out. I can preview. So here's a preview of what um, this email looks like. And of course, I can send a test email very quickly. So there you go. That's your template manager.